Dear friends, namaste, and that's from Neek Wake, right in front of you. And friends, here I shall be telling you about pranayama for asthma. Now, there are several good pranayamas for asthma, and here I'll be talking to you about a pranayama, which is called as the deep chest breathing. Now, friends, remember that in pranayama, it's always abdominal breathing. Only there are a couple of pranayamas where the breathing pattern reverses, which is chest breathing. And this is one of those. So deep chest breathing is an exercise where we try to expand the lung capacity. When you do your deep chest breathing, what you do is that you keep your one hand on your abdomen as you sit comfortably. When you inhale, you very slowly, very, very slowly, you contract your abdomen inwards. And slowly you try to expand your chest like this. That means when you inhale, you're going to be doing three things. Number one. Your starting position is your hands are on the knees, okay? And when you start inhaling, slowly your hands start going backwards, the abdomen starts sinking inwards, and the chest starts going outwards, and slowly you take your hands all the way like this to the thighs. When you exhale again, you slowly start taking your hands uh, back to the knees, and slowly your abdomen starts expanding outwards all the way to the count of 10. So that means you're going to be inhaling deep all the way to the count of 10 and you're going to be exhaling deep also all the way to the count of 10. Now there are three, four movements. Try to understand you nicely. When you inhale, your abdomen slowly starts sinking inwards and your chest slowly starts expanding outwards. Number two. Your hands slowly start moving all the way from the knees like this to the thigh. That means your shoulders will go up like this as you inhale completely. As you start exhaling, again your hands start going towards the knees and your shoulders start coming back to the normal position and your abdomen starts moving outwards as you start exhaling. So by the time you've completely exhaled, your abdomen has completely moved outwards. That would complete your one round of this pranayama called deep chest breathing. Now remember in this pranayama, you're going to be breathing in to the count of 10 and breathing out to the count of 10. That means it's going to be a deep inhalation followed by deep exhalations. And remember friend, this is a good pranayama for people suffering from asthma, lung congestion and bronchitis. Okay friend, do take care of yourself and have a great day ahead.